Hello, Boise State. I'm Taylor Littman, and this is your Arbiter Minute for the week of October 7th, 2015. Fingerprint scanners now rest in the pockets of millions of Americans, but this new form of biometric security brings new problems. The recent breach in the United States Office of Personnel Management comprised the fingerprints of approximately 5.6 million individuals and is raising concerns over these biometric security measures. Greb Hampikian, Professor of Biology and Criminal Justice of Boise State, and Richard Hickman, Computer Forensics Expert, talk about the potential cost of using biometrics. The wake of last week's total lunar eclipse and the discovery of evidence for water on Mars has piqued many students' interest in space. Fortunately, there are opportunities at Boise State for further development of this interest, one of which is Space Broncos. Space Broncos is a space-oriented student organization aimed at providing outreach programs for the community, research projects, and connections with NASA. They work closely with former astronaut and current distinguished educator and residents, Steve Swanson, on projects to further knowledge about space and engineering. Students of any major who are interested in space are welcome to join. The Boise State's women's swimming and diving team has been involved in a bit of a shakeup with the team's coaching staff. On July 20th, head coach and founder of the program, Kristen Hill, announced she was stepping down from her position. The new coaching positions have been filled by new head coach Jeremy Kipp, assistant coach Megan Hawthorne, and diving coach Brandon Bladesell. The swim team's first meet of the season will be on October 10th, a dual meet versus the University of Idaho Vandals in their home pool, the Boise State YMCA. That has been your weekly Arbiter Minute, and thank you for watching. For more information on these and other stories, visit us on the web at arbiteronline.com.